Oh, what is up, my beautiful mangas? My name is the Iron Mango, and today uh, I am bringing you guys episode two of my Ark Survival Evolved Dozy Air series. So essentially, in this series, for those guys who don't know, I just showcase some awesome, awesome new dinosaurs that are going to be added to the Ark Survival Evolved game. If you guys don't know what the Ark Survival Evolved game is, essentially, it's an awesome, awesome open world survival sandbox sort of game, kind of like Minecraft on steroids, like with super high definition graphics and some dinosaurs thrown into the mix. It's an awesome, awesome game. I'm currently doing a Let's Play on my channel. I just posted episode one, like. Like a day ago, I think yesterday or maybe two days ago. I'm not quite sure yet, but essentially, it's on an awesome, awesome multiplayer server with some other awesome YouTubers. So, if you guys go check it out and enjoy it as much as I am enjoying playing it because it is a ton of fun, I hope to delve deeper into the game very, very soon and just do a lot of other awesome, cool things in the game. So, I hope you guys are excited about that. But essentially, in today's episode, we're gonna be showcasing the Mosasaurus. It's like a crocodile slash lizard sort of underwater animal, it's a giant animal as well. I don't even really know if you can call these things animals, they're dinosaurs, dude. I mean, dinosaurs aren't animals, but they are awesome, awesome dinosaurs. This is the Mosasaurus. It's an awesome, like, lizard, giant lizard type of animal. It goes underwater. They're very, very slow. Uh, but essentially, it's in the new Jurassic World movie and the other Jurassic Park movies as well. So I'm very excited for this dinosaur to be added to the Ark Survival Evolve game. So we're going to look over the uh, different notes that are putting down on this dossier. So its common name is the Mosasaurus. Its species is the Mosasaurus Subitra. The time is the late Cretaceous. So I think that's around 70 million years ago, like, towards the end of the dinosaur period. That's when these guys lived around. Oh, my God. Look how menacing that thing looks. Look how menacing that thing looks. But its diet is is a carnivore so it does eat meat dude so you don't want to be anywhere close to this thing this thing will eat you dudes it is going to be very very scary if you guys are uh, close to this thing and it's not like fully tamed it has an aggressive temperament as well so that's not good as well if you guys are <laughs> planning on going near these things if it's not fully tamed so it says wild until recently i believe the ultra megalodon to be the greatest of the ocean predators that's another uh, awesome aquatic animal or aquatic dinosaur i guess you could say the ultra megalodon to be the greatest of the ocean predators then i discovered mosasaurus supitra in the deeps not quite as fast but much larger and stronger the Mosasaurus rules the deep waters off the island. Growing up to 50 feet long, Mosasaurus is larger than almost every other aquatic creature I've encountered thus far. Yes, it is a very, very big creature, dudes. I would not want to be in suck in the water with that thing, especially if that thing's chasing after you're just like swimming. That would be very, very scary, dudes. Let's go over to the next uh, little bit of a note over here. It says, contrary to common belief, Mosasaurus cannot breathe underwater. Rather, it can hold its breath an incredibly long period of time. Similar to a whale, Mosasaurus, a deep sea marine lizard, not a fish, it spends most of its time in the deeps and only comes up to the surface to breathe or chase prey with engulfing chop with an engulfing chop that, that, that would be very look how big its jaws dudes that would be very very menacing i'm not gonna lie but it also says domesticated despite its power mosasaurus is not ideal for all deep water activities its slower swim speed makes the risk of drowning much higher when using tylosaurus to reach oil deposits or silica pearls Having one with you as an escort, on the other hand, is probably the best oceanic defense available. So I think you're not going to want to really ride these guys, but you're going to want to have them like as an escort. You're going to want to tame one of these guys and have them around you, like near you when you're actactually are exploring the depths of the ocean, because it can be very, very dangerous in the ocean. There's like sharks and crocodiles and other cool stuff like that. But imagine if you have like a 50 foot long dinosaur, just like, just like protecting you. That would be absolutely sick, dudes. But I think that's going to be the end of today's episode of the Ark Survival Evolved Dozier. So if you guys have any other dinosaurs you'd like me to showcase in the future, Definitely let me know down below in the comment section. Go check out my episode one of my Ark Survival Evolved Let's Play as well because it is an awesome, awesome game. And I do post a lot of other Minecraft videos as well if you guys are interested in Minecraft. I post around two to three new videos every single day. So if you guys go check those out if you haven't already. But without further ado, I hope you guys did enjoy today's episode. Slap that like and like button and that little button that says subscribe if you guys did. Let's try to go for 100 likes on today's video. That will make Marco Pitter Patter, dudes. But I hope you guys have a nice, safe, wonderful day.